In the depths of the Atlantic Ocean, a remarkable discovery has been made. A 120,000-year-old city, known as the Lost City, has been unearthed, challenging our understanding of life in extreme environments. Discovered in 2000, this underwater marvel lies hidden beneath the waves. Featuring colossal spires and giant monoliths that tower over 60 meters high. The landscape is alien, unlike anything else on our planet. But it's not just the stunning rock formations that make the lost city extraordinary. It's the life that thrives there, in complete darkness. Bizarre creatures, snails, crustaceans, crabs, and shrimp, have adapted to survive by consuming chemicals emitted by underwater vents. These vents release hydrogen, methane, and other gases, creating a unique environment that can exist without oxygen or sunlight. Instead of relying on photosynthesis, the ecosystem is powered by chemical reactions on the ocean floor. This groundbreaking finding offers scientists a glimpse into how life might have begun on Earth billions of years ago. It even suggests the possibility of life on other planets or moons like Europa and Enceladus. The Lost City is estimated to be at least 120,000 years old, making it significantly older than any known black smoker vents by at least two orders of magnitude. Its towering structures, nearly pure carbonate, the same material as limestone in caves, stand as a testament to the enduring force of life. However, this ancient wonder faces a potential threat. In 2018, Poland secured rights to mine the deep sea near the site, raising concerns about damage to this fragile ecosystem. Scientists are now calling for the lost city to be listed as a World Heritage Site to ensure its protection for future generations. As we continue to explore the depths of our oceans, discoveries like the lost city remind us that there is still much to learn about life on our planet and potentially beyond. This underwater city, thriving without sunlight for thousands of years, challenges our conventional wisdom and opens new possibilities for understanding the origins of life itself.